Hey everyone, Karan here welcoming you back to Tales of the Abyss. In the last episode, we started going through the replica lab, the Abyss. Yeah, we finally learned what the game was titled and why it was titled that way. And in this episode, we are going to continue on. Now, we got all the generators in the first part of this dungeon. And, well, when we open the door... What? M Major? Sink! And Arietta! Father! No, Largo! Only Dis would leave behind replicas of such bad taste. He must have been quietly taking their data before. What a bastard. We aren't going to have to fight them, are we? If they bear no ill will, I imagine we can merely leave them alone. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna work. But it appears this isn't going to end peacefully. We have to fight them. Again! Why? Why do I have to keep fighting the same people over and over? Because this is a JRPG, of course you do! Major! Unfortunately, it doesn't look like there's time for sentiment. Damn it! Forgive me! And so we get ourselves a fight against we bunches of replicas! Yay! Howly! Alright. Well, go ahead and take them in regards to the ones that I'm going to fight first. Here! Sink! You notice? One thing actually you will notice about these is even in hard mode, these guys aren't all that difficult. They lowered the stats on them a little bit to make up for the fact that there's four of them in one battle, so if you focus on one, you shouldn't be in too bad a shape. That said, I'm going to run... Oh, that is who I want to fight. I'm going to run away from Largo here. Now, fortunately, though... Okay, yeah, I don't care for that. Eat you. Now, oh crap. I will go ahead and mention, though... You're not going to need to worry about trying to steal any items from them, so don't be too, uh, oh wow. Okay, wow, uh, yeah, that's about to kill me, so let's mm, take measures against that. Nope. But don't worry about trying to steal any items from them, they don't have them. Okay, 53,000, no thank you, nope. Blah, blah. How did that, oh god, we're dead. This is bad. Uh, Tear, please come back. Okay, la 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 la. Oh crap! I walked right into it. Go me. Not apple gel. I want to use my lemon gel, please. Okay. Now, the main reason that, like I mentioned, the main reason I want to go ahead and fight this battle, or go ahead and take Sink out first, is because he is the fastest one, and if I can get him down, life is probably going to be a lot easier. Okay, but I still have, but I haven't managed to hit him any, so I got to. There we go. See if I can trick him into doing stuff. There we go. There we go. Now I can get a few good hits in. Nope. Okay, this is not going well for Tear at all. Oh, man, no. Oh, shut up. Okay. Uh, huh. This battle's not going as well as I thought it would. Oh. Oh, God. And that trapped me. Shoot. <sighs> ah, dang it. That's going to take Tear out. Um, Anis, you've got to bring me back. Okay. I know you are. And I'm trapped, so... Ah, Jesus, there goes Tear. Um, okay, well, first off, heal myself just in case. Here it comes. Sharpness. Yeah, I don't care. I've got to try to kite. Oh, twisted door, open wide. Negative gate. Take this. Okay, good. That's going to pause him long enough for me to heal. Uh, Tear first. All right, so I'm going to have to do some dedicated item usage here. 
All right, this is gonna be bloody howling. Heal her first. Okay. Oh Jesus, I walked into that. Okay, um, Tears about to die again. Thank you. Okay. Uh, all right. I am probably gonna have to bring them back here. Okay, good. All right. Uh, let's see. Okay, he's running after me. Let me bring back Annis. Move! There we go. Ha, ah, just in time, too. Uh, okay. Lemon gel. Tear! Oh, God. Oh, dang it! Not quite. Okay. Alright. Over limit time. Okay, good. And screw you! Go, Mystic Art, go! Alright, good. That gets him down a fair bit. So he's a little more than halfway down. Alright. Lemon gel on Anis. Because my AI is better. Nope. No, thank you. Okay, move. Move. That's going to hit J. That almost takes Anis out. Um, I'm going to start using miracles. Oh crap. No, shoot, I'm dead. Yep. <laughs> I'm dead. I screwed up. Oh wait, that's Guy's line. Uh, okay, Anis. You. Miracle Jade. There we go. Good, that buys time to bring me back. And Jade goes down, no surprise. Okay. Apple gel on Anis. There we go. Okay, good. Not good. Um. Alright. I probably... I probably should have gone after... Um, probably should have gone after uh, Arietta first, actually. Okay, so I... So, An uh, Tear's dead again. Okay. Let's see. Alright, I'm gonna have to bring Tear back again. Watch yourself, sorry. All right, good God, twenty-four thousand. Okay. All right. All right, I gotta get him to kite me. It, tears dead again? Good God, uh, Annis. Thank you. Okay, good. All right, Jesus, we're just not doing much damage at all. It's a problem. All right. I might end up What's using all my life bottles by the end of this. Oh crap, I just walked here right into it. That's my fault. Yeah, I know. Oh good. Got some good combo damage there. Really? How did I just get walked into that? Oh. Uh, heal me please. Really? That was cheap. I had her queued up to use an item and it didn't, so I gotta focus on healing myself first, unfortunately. Oh god. No. Okay, that gives me time. Alright, Tear, I gotta start using the life bottles just on Tear now. Okay. Really? You're using that on Tear? Ah. Okay, good. At least I got out in time. Oh, quit hitting tear, will you? Okay, where's 11,000 shoot? And that's gonna hit her too. God. I forgot how bad this battle was. Granted, this is on hard mode, so obviously bad. But it is especially bad in this one, of course. Bloody Howling, that's going to hit Tear. So I'm going to start miracling her. Okay, there we go. Ha, there we go. Good. That's a good time for that. Okay, because that gives me time 
to heal myself, myself with a miracle. And sinks down to 3,400. Thank God. Uh-uh. Ah! Good. I was trying to hold on to that uh, to try to take out... Uh, try to take out Saint. Oh, good. Perfect. Screw you. Wow. Uh, okay. Move! Jesus! Well, perfect timing, I guess. Uh, no. Nope, not gonna do it. There we go, good. Finally, Sink is out of the battle. Now that we've got one of them down, I am going after Arietta next. So... Now, I will do that. Let's see. Let me get the info up on her here. Now, the problem you're going to notice is when Sink dies, Legretta pops into the picture. So, that makes it a little problematic to try to take all four of them out. But, I'm going to... God dang it! Oh, God, and I'm going to hit by negative gate, too. Shoot! And by Arietta. Oh, God. That's going to hit Annis? Yes. Okay, good. Uh, alright. I've got to bring Tear back. Oh, I don't care. Not right now, anyway. I'm not going to risk that hitting. God, it hit Tear again? Good lord, okay. Well, I've got to hear, heal myself here. Okay, yeah, well, I know you're hitting me, so... Oh, God. Oh, so much magic. Oh God! Run! Thank God! Oh shit! Whoopsie. Okay. Good, that missed. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to cuss, but uh. Oh no! I've got four life bottles left. Oh gosh. Um. And Ari Arietta's. Okay, run away from that. All right. See, that's the thing, though. A Claret Alarms has no charge time. Whereas, Negative Gate does. Okay. Just basically, whenever she goes silent, I've got to... Okay, she's casting. Okay. Oh, God. All right. I gotta wait till both of those cast. Why did you even do that? And um, all right, oh, I gotta heal myself. Shut up! I don't care. Run. Okay. Okay. I gotta risk bringing Tear back. Watch yourself. Sorry. Oh, twisted door. Open wide. Negative gates. All right, and I am gonna use my hourglass to stop time so that we can heal. Okay, good. That'll give me a chance to heal Tear, and that'll give her a chance to resurrect. Okay, good. Good. Okay, so that brought back Jade. All right. Oh God! Run! Wow. Okay, and keep Tear healed. Watch out too. Uh, uh, okay. Good. Ah! No. Okay. Let's see. Let me use a specific for everybody. There we go. Shut up, Tear! I don't care. Want to try to get Annis off the battlefield? Okay. Good. Uh, that takes her down to 13 grand over limit time. Run! Oh, God. No. Okay, good. I had to do that. I didn't want to engage the overlimit so early, but since she had gotten bloody howling on me, I wanted to make sure I didn't die, because Tear's dead again. Again. Great. Okay. Alright. Good. Good. Bad. Okay, um, she's charging. She's doing a spell, so... Get out of the way. Heal. 
All right. Let's see. Miracle. <laughs> all right. Now, all right. Legretta's third up on my list for obvious reasons. Oh, God. Run. Okay. Good. <laughs> all right. Life... No, not life bottle yet. That's not what I meant to do. Uh, let me get the stats up first. All right. Legretta, 75,000, so I'm going to have a heck of a time taking her down. Take this. All right. Actually, let me check, uh, let me check, uh, Largo while we're at it, because he's sink, he's just kind of slinking over. Oh, 15,000, I can do that. Take him out, just have one person on the battlefield. Oh, oh, but I need to change my targets first. Nope, don't care. Okay. Run. Basically kite him quickly. And as long as I can run away from her attacks and kite him into attacking, I can get a few good hits. Oh god, run! RUN! I'm trapped! Oh god. No! Are you freaking kidding me? Oh, I hate the arena limit. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, well, after another, oh, about 13 minutes of filming, bleh, I'm finally back to just having Legretta on the battlefield. This, well, after what happened last time has gone a lot better, mostly because I have been using my items shamelessly to try to keep everybody on the battlefield, and that's going to hit three people at once. Uh, yeah, this could be bad. Uh, I might as well go ahead and prepare for that. Specific! There we go. Okay. Now, what I was going to do, I think I already drew up Legretta, but I'll just go ahead and pop her up again. But once you're down to one, obviously, it gets a lot easier, but it's getting through the other three to get to just having the one to be easier. Boy. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Uh, Legretta is actually already about, has about a third of her HP down, so we're in pretty decent shape in regards to that. Okay, let's see. Well, three people casting at once. Uh, hey, kite me, please. Not quite. There we go. Good, got her. We've got her trapped now. And we've got pretty much unlimited healing going, and we've got her over-limited. No, oh god, run. Well, that didn't help. Come on. Uh-oh. Well, I'm dead. And Jade's dead, too. Well, almost, okay. Well, that doesn't help. But fortunately, she's almost gone, so... Good. Bring me back. And I'll have to bring Tear back then. Uh, down to 10 grand, though. We're not doing too badly, actually. Another thing that you might notice, I still have more than half my life bottles left because I've been saving them for Tear and trying to keep all the HPs up quickly, so that has helped a lot, too. Okay, 2300. We can burn her down. There we go. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That was awful. Uh, you noticed six minutes on that successful battle, and I died twice after surviving, or after getting killed the first time. I died two more times trying to get to the attempt where I actually succeeded. So, yay! All right, and sorry, I'm trying to call my maps back up here because we've got more of this place left. We're not done, unfortunately. Okay, let me cook and get all the good stuff in. Blood Spirit. Uh, e plus. Okay, that'll work. That was a surprise. They were no less powerful than their originals. Considering the flawlessness of these replicas, it was almost certainly, or it's almost certain that it was dist work. They were replicas, but they had their own wills to some degree. Dist must have taught them for a while. And then he just trapped them here? What was he thinking? They felt stronger than their originals to me. How can that be? The original method I designed created replicas like them, stronger than their originals. But in exchange, they have a variety of problems. 
What did they do for food? There's nothing in here but monsters. When we leave here, let's make graves for them. Their bodies disappeared because of the phonon separation, but I can't just stand around doing nothing. Mew! Guys, the detector's still showing a replica signature. I know it sounds harsh, but we can't stay here forever. Yes, let's keep going. So we get Gold Detector, which... Actually, let me go ahead and show it to you along with the rest of the items we picked up. Ah, uh, let's see. Stat boosting items, pretty much. Okay, let's see. Anything new? No new, no new weapons. No new armor. Ah, uh, we got a blue dice. Well, we already had that. Let's see. Uh, I'm not sure what we got, but I'll have to check and see what items they were. I skipped past them too fast. Okay, let's see. The gold detector. There's my new capacity core, of course. All right, gold detector. There we go. Who knows? You might find some gold just by walking around with a nice Pac-Man insignia there. So yeah, you will randomly get gold just by traveling around, so that helps too. Especially since we're down a pretty good bit of gold, actually, because of all this. So let us march on and continue. Okay, I think we... Oh god, we've got different enemies, so let me go ahead and fight them and show them to you. You're dead! Alright, we have the Great Fiendlin, which is the only one of those three that we had not yet seen. Let's see, let me call up Great Fiendlin here. Pretty powerful, so we might want to uh, might want to go after him, but really what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to focus on getting the numbers down first, especially since these Fiendlins are relatively easy to stagger. I mean, you notice, there they are. Okay, and we got Bloody Howling and Prism Sword all at once, nice. Okay, uh, Jade's somehow about to die. That's bad. Yes, please heal Jade. And Jade runs right out of it. Good job. Okay, well, we've got... Wow, that's a big sword he's got. Mystic Cage! Whack. Unfortunately, these enemies are strong enough that they're not going to die due to that. At least most of them, anyway. Uh, let's see. Oop. What you got, 20,000? Okay, cool. I'll take that. Let's see if we can take this guy down and then get... Yeah, there we go. Now let's all mass ourselves on the last one. And we should, I think, be good to go. Yeah. Guess that does it. Ah, thank you. Appreciate it. Definitely important to have good food in here if you don't have good items. Okay, we can go north from here. That's actually the only direction we can go. Alright, I think we've got one more. Let's see. This is, okay, up to... That's the gate room, replica room, three, four. Okay, so yeah, we got one more room to go north. No, we don't. Okay, so we got northwest and northeast. Uh, we actually need to take both. So, let me not get trapped. Let me go northwest first, because it'll take us directly to a generator room and a heal room, too. Alright, generator room here. A uh, new enemy, it looks like, so let me take out the Jenny and then fight the new enemy here. Hmm, the so Sludge to Tortoise! That sounds fun, doesn't it? Alright, Sludge Torty! Here! 101,000 HP and a resistance to physical attacks. Oh boy. So fun. But fortunately, you notice, fairly easy to actually stagger, so... Now, my question then is, or I guess the question you're facing, is how do you figure out which side is which? <laughs> because this guy, it looks like he's got those eyes all over the place. Oh, wow, we're halfway down on its HP already, okay. That works. Well, I guess the I guess the edge is decided by where it sticks its head out of. Oh boy. Okay, go ahead and stagger you. Wow, 38 hits. And okay, you're almost dead. Uh, let me stick. Let me get out of here. Don't want you to stick your head out there on me. All right, good. That'll take it down. Negative gate will pretty much take it down to its finish. Once it gets up, we should be good to kill it. There we go. I just keep getting better. Oh, and I got a new ad skill. Sweet. Two ad skills. Three ad skills. Four ad skills. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Oh my god. Oh, holy crap. Wow, lots of ad skills. I'm gonna have to check them all out now. 
Alright, add skills. Luke has a bunch of stuff. Decreases damage when taken. Okay. Uh, let's see. Void magic. That's nice. XP plus. Yay! Come back. Okay, I can. Oh, tap square to repeat the, to shorten the stagger period. That's good. Combo counter. When a t or, I guess, command counter or something like that. Lucky Soul recovers TP. Cool. E plus increases damage of elemental attacks, which I don't have. Void staggering. Okay. Item Rover increases stealing, which I could have used earlier in the game. Item Getter increases acquiring. Long step increases my back step distance. Okay. Well, all useful. All right, let's see. Now that we've gotten the Jenny out of the way, let's go northwest. And then we need to go northwest again because northeast is another trap and I need to get my holy bottles back on. Sorry. There we go. Okay. Run away, enemies. Run away. I don't want to fight you anymore. Northwest will take us to another generator room. So, goodbye, Jenny. Then we need to go to pick up items. We need to go southwest. And, let's see. Go ahead and grab the item in there, which actually will be helpful because we've been using a bunch of them before. Uh, where are you, item? There you are. Hi. We pick up another holy bottle. Yay! Now we need to go southwest... Uh, you know, uh, west, rather, sorry. Thought southwest for a second. We need to go west again, because we have a healing room. Yay! Definitely useful. All right, now from there, let's see. Let me try to figure out the best way to proceed here, back in the Jenny room. Okay, we need to go both ways, really, to get to all the generators. Best way to go, though, I think, is... Let's see. Okay, go northwest from the Jenny room. Because we've got another item we can pick up here, so go ahead and avoid you, please. Thank you. Uh, avoid you, too. Don't want to fight you now that I already have. Okay, and then that will allow us to go in and get another item if I don't get myself killed first. Ah, uh, yeah, you're up there. Go figure. Okay, and we get a good near, which is obviously a spear for Jade. We've already gotten one, though, so I don't think it's going to be any more powerful than what he has. All right, now from here, we need to go northwest to get into another Jenny room. And then switch back to Mew Attack, obviously, to take it out. Uh, run away. It said run away. All right, now what we need to do, actually, is go ahead and go east to get an item, and then proceed north a couple of rooms from there to get to another Jenny room. All right, where's this item? There you are. Red Saffron. Ooh, good. Definitely like the stat-boosting items. Okay, you got one more up here, of course, and then we are done with this little section. Now, what we'll probably want to do is, obviously, take out this Jenny. And you notice my gold is starting to get a little low. Fortunately, I think we should be okay, but I don't want to risk it. Okay, let's see. What do I need to do? Uh, I might have to actually fight some... Um, let's see, this is a treasure room, so I need to go east from here and then go southwest into another Jenny room. But I might need to be careful. I might actually want to think about lowering the amount I'm paying Sheba or just fight you. And then we magically get another 20,000 gold, which is definitely nice. Okay, let's see. Go down from here. Alright, this should... Yeah, Jenny room. Okay, good. Alright, now from here, we need to go... Oh god, uh, my holy bottle's off. Let's fix that. <laughs> we need to go down southwest again. That will connect us actually to where we had been previously. Let's see, because we've got, all right, treasure, a uh, treat that I can't use. Uh, let me see if I can use one, actually. Nope. All right, well, fair enough. Now, let's see, that's treat, okay. All right, yeah, I need to go southwest from here to connect. All right, good. Now, let's see, go ahead and kill you. 
And there is... Um, actually, I will do this because the treasure chest in this room has 20,000 gold, so that will pay for itself and then a little bit if Sheba would ever move. <laughs> All right. There. Nope. There you aren't. Uh, you are up the ladder? Yeah, there you are. Okay, good. All right. So from here, we need to go back up to the Jenny room, and then we have to go a couple rooms east. And in doing so, let me fight you. Okay, and continue on basically east from here. Because we've got another treasure room and it'll open up the way to what is coming next. Okay, golden slime. Uh, yeah, let me kill you. Man, this one was loaded. Battle's barely over and she's already got the money. Leave it to Annis. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to keep that part in. But you notice, yeah, good money. And I actually almost did my highest ranking and my highest combo on that monster because I got to think a 55 hit combo before that one killed over. So yeah, worked pretty nicely and I can't use a miracle gel. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, there we go. All right. I don't know what it healed on tier, but it healed enough. Okay, from here we need to go north. All right, and then we've got a uh, Jenny room. Go ahead and kill it. Now, you notice we're going for 29 generators. We've already gotten all the ones over here. So now we have tw we've got 25. Okay, let's go north from here. And then once we go north from here, we actually can't avoid a trap room because northeast and northwest, both of them are trap rooms. And you'll notice what they do is they shock you and can drain Sheba, so be very careful with that. We have to go through here, though, to get to the next Jenny room. So let's go back real quick. And then head east from here. Okay. That will allow us to get to another treasure, which we will... Let's see, we're going to have to climb to get to this one again. Uh, let me look around here. I don't know for sure. Looks like we are, although I'm not sure to where or how I'm supposed to do that. Uh, that, that is a really good question, actually. Where am I supposed to climb to? Let's see. Because, yeah, this is saying this is a treasure room. Am I just missing it, maybe? Whirl around here and, oh god, uh, holy bottle myself again. Okay. Let's see. Let me... Well, I don't know if the treasure is actually in here. It says it's a treasure room, but I can't seem to find the freaking... There it is. Pfft. Ran past it twice. Good God. Well, I'm not going to be able to live that down for a bit. Okay, sorry. Calling the map back up, it disappeared again. Ah, uh, doggone it. All right. There we go. Okay. All right. Go ahead and open this. And we kind of have to go up here. Pretty much from here on, actually, for the most part, it is areas where you are required to go. So, since... Let's see. Okay, we got a scene. I, I'm sorry. Can we rest for a little? This is a bit rough, even for me. Yeah, we have been walking non-stop for a while. Let's take a break. Yes. Fortunately, I don't sense any immediate danger here. Let's rest. Okay. You think those four replicas were what Dist sealed in here? I wonder. If the detector is still reacting, then it may be something else. Huh. I, man, I wonder how deep this place goes. Yeah, I thought we'd come a long way, but the more we dig, the more we find. As you can see by your map. Are you ladies feeling alright? Although, knowing you all, you'd answer yes even if you were pushing yourselves. My, if you know the answer, then that was a silly question, wasn't it? I can still fight. Yeah, we don't have time to stay depressed. With the girls working this hard, I guess I can't just up and say I'm feeling tired. I'm okay now, let's go. Alright, unfortunately it doesn't really do much as far as actually resting us, but... Okay, let's see, that's the last... Well, the 
almost last Jenny, but I do actually need to go ahead and talk to Sheba and get his payment down. I'm going to cut it in half. Yeah, it's going to sap more out of him, but at this point in time, he's got plenty of sapping health, and I have very little money, but let me kill you and fix that. Okay, well, now that we've got our money problems pretty much solved, what we have to do from here, basically, is just keep going north until you get to another generator room, so not really much to talk about in terms of just straight-out strategy and etc. here. Alright, hello, Jenny. Let me kill you here. Alright, now from here, we need to head east, actually, to another item room. A, an item room we where we have an item where it's actually kind of worth picking up. Uh, are you up here? Or are you just a deception? You're not. Okay, cool. There we go. Elemental circlet. So, nice helmet type item if you're into using that, but I don't particularly. Go ahead and move through here. Then we've got, I think, one more empty room before we come to the final generator room. Yay! So, let's kill the final Jenny. And, yeah, we get ourselves another door. Let's make sure we're healed up, because I'm not cutting the episode here. No, thank you. I'm going to finish this in this episode, darn it. Go ahead and open this up and see what we find. If the Oracle Knights were sealed behind one door, what will we find sealed behind the other? <laughs>